While test driving a customer vehicle, you suspect that the wheel bearing is defective and must be exchanged. Back in the workshop, your suspicion is confirmed. Start by removing the front wheel. The brake caliper and the brake disc are next. Use this special tool to remove the grease cap. Then unscrew the clamping nuts. And take off the wheel hub. Because the brake caliper dust shield is later exchanged, unscrew it too. Undo three screws. Now take a look at the bearing surface of the wheel hub sealing ring in the steering knuckle. Here the corrosion is clearly visible. Take the RPM sensor out of the steering knuckle. Then clean the front wheel spindle with a cloth. Use a wire brush to remove the surface corrosion of the bearing surface. And again, use a cloth for a final clean. The new sponge rubber seal for the RPM sensor provides for a better seal. Now the brake caliper dust shield is next. Take note, left and right are different. Here too, the extended sponge rubber provides for a better seal. Exchange the three screws and tighten the screws with a torque of 14 Newton meters. Now the new wheel hub comes into play. The stainless steel bearing race is new. On installation, the ring is automatically pressed onto the corroded bearing surface of the wheel hub sealing ring in the steering knuckle. Push the wheel hub onto the front axle spindle. Caution, the wheel hub may not be offset. Then turn the clamping nut until the wheel hub hits the block. With that, the stainless steel bearing race fits correctly on the bearing surface. Exercise caution. If the repaired wheel hub is then removed, the stainless steel bearing race remains behind on the bearing surface of the steering knuckle. If you were to now install a new wheel hub, then you damage the lip of the wheel hub sealing ring. That's why a new wheel hub sealing ring with a stainless steel bearing race is included in the repair set for a second assembly. Lever out the old bearing race from the steering knuckle. Then remove the old wheel hub sealing ring from the wheel hub. Place the new wheel hub sealing ring in the wheel hub. And install it using the special tool. Caution! The stainless steel bearing race reduces the diameter of the wheel hub sealing ring. That's why you turn the stamp tool with the plastic ring 180 degrees so that the wheel hub sealing ring is on the back of the stamp. To tighten the wheel hub sealing ring, place it in a vise. Now back to the first assembly. After you've tightened the wheel hub with the clamping nut, set the bearing plate to two hundredths of a millimeter.
Fill the grease cap with a small amount of wheel bearing grease and attach the cap to the wheel hub using the installation tool. Before you reinstall the brake disc, check the bearing area for corrosion. Renew the fixing bolt. Tighten with a torque of 10 Newton meters. Also use new screws when installing the brake caliper and pay attention to the correct torque. Once the wheel is on the vehicle, take it down from the car lift and onto the road.